So surface design, as we all know, can be a little bit confusing. And in this video, I want to talk about designing a surface versus designing for surfaces. I think there's a fundamental difference and it causes a lot of confusion and frustration. Um, as a service designer, one of the things that comes back over and over in our field is the fact that we rarely get to implement uh, what we have come up with. And the reason is that you usually in a project don't have the authority or the power or the mandate to design a holistic end-to-end -end service experience. It, it rarely happens. I'd say 99% of the cases you're not designing a completely new service. And even if you were, uh, there are so many moving parts. So if we're not designing a service, what are we doing then? I think in most cases, service designers are designing the context in which a service happens. So I've referenced um, music as a metaphor um, in another video. Uh, about service design and I think it works well in this case as well. So the metaphor here is that you're designing the environment in which the music has to uh, emerge. The musicians will play the music but you as a service designer can uh, design the lighting, you can make sure that the seats are arranged well, you can make sure that, that an audience actually appears, you can make sure that the right kind of music is played. So if we look at what we're doing as service designers, it's often designing the context for which services um, happen. And that brings us to the case that we might not be designing as service, but we might design these, be designing for services. And that's quite a fundamental difference. Um, so yeah, that's, that's my take. Is service design really about designing a service or designing for services? What do you think? Let me know, leave a comment down below. And if you wanna see the video uh, where I talk about how service design is related to music and especially jazz music, check out the video over here because you can learn more about that. See you over there.